Good afternoon, Central Cambria. I'm Hannah. And I'm Juliana. Today is Tuesday, November 24th, 2015, and it is day five of our weekly schedule. For lunch today, we are having breakfast for lunch. We will not be broadcasting tomorrow, so have a very happy Thanksgiving. Now over to Sports with Max. Hello, Central Cambria. I'm Max. Gobble, gobble. The Central Cambria Red Devils hockey team visited the Cambria County War Memorial to play the Johnstown Trojans last night in hopes of their sixth straight win. The varsity skaters came away with a 5-1 victory in the very physical contest. Our Red Devils now sit on top of the Laurel Mountain Conference with an undefeated 6-0 record. The next game is Monday, November 30th, at home against second place Altoona. Face-off is scheduled for 7.30 p.m. at the NCRC. Please come out and support your team. Don't forget that next Wednesday is the Junior Senior Boys Powder Puff Volleyball Game. Everyone is welcome to come out and support your classmates in a great cause. The game starts at 7.30. Now, in more hockey fun, over to Beth with a feature video on the Tommy Hawk's visit. On Tuesday, November 10, 2015, the auditorium quickly filled up for a presentation on the Johnstown Tomahawks. Head coach Nick Shackford discussed the importance of leadership, being courageous, and also being courteous towards others, both on the ice and off. Now we're to an interview with a few of the players and the head coach himself. Hi, I'm Andrew Romano. I'm from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, and I play for the Tomahawks. And I'm Logan Hudson. I'm from Kalamazoo, Michigan, and I also play for the Johnstown Tomahawks. Uh, today we're here to talk about a little bit about character, uh, leadership, and uh, how that can tie in with hockey and also how we can uh, help you guys. How you doing? My name is Nick Shackford. I am a coach with the Johnstown Tomahawks. Uh, I am here uh, today to talk about leadership, character, and uh, how that uh, goes along with hockey and um, how we can help you guys and, and some useful tools to, to, to get better at those things. Thank you to Bryce Boring, Shane Hunt, Kyle Eckenrod, Devin Haggins, and Jordan Grove for making this presentation possible and a success. This is Evan with the weather. I'm here standing on this fake pile of snow. <laughs> There's a current temperature of 35 with a high of 40 and a low of 25. <laughs> the UV index is low and there's a 25% chance of precipitation. Over to God. <laughs> Good afternoon, Central Camera. I'm Hannah. When life seems really difficult, when your dad has lost his job, or your mom has grounded you for two weeks, or you've argued with a close friend, it can be really hard to focus on what's good and right in the world. It's a challenge to be grateful for anything. There's an old African proverb, if something that was going to chop your head off only knocked off your cap, you should be grateful. In other words, things could always be worse and useful to stop and think about what's right and good in the world. Like proof over, like a roof over your head, the clothes on your back, and the privilege of getting an education. I want you to take a moment right now and think about what you're grateful for. That's what Thanksgiving is all about. Have a grateful holiday. Happy birthday today to Cassidy Gellarmino, and happy birthday over to break to Justin Byrne, Seth Leap, Caitlin Dillon, Nick Knopp, Campbell Moss, Jacoby Myers, Michael Oyaski, Lizzie Wright, and Dylan Mc. Hello. Sorry. <laughs> Don't forget that ARC stands for the atmosphere of respect and the courtesy and the courage to stand up for what's right, Central Cambria. Now over to the Giggle Gang. <sighs> Max, are you going on a trip to Jamaica soon? No, why? Because <laughs> you're Jamaican me crazy. Signing off from CCTV. Have a great day, Central Cambria. <laughs> <laughs>